This is The Lockpicking Lawyer, and what I have for you today is this Vero padlock. It's the model 554-CP745. But in particular, I want to talk about one of its most prominent features, and that is the plastic shackle guard. It's something I'm starting to see more and more often. In fact, in just a minute of searching through my collection, I found several of them, and I have mixed feelings about this. Now obviously, if the choice is between a metal shackle guard and a plastic one, I'm almost always going to go for the metal one. The exceptions are niche uses, things like non-spark environments, or applications where avoiding scratches is more important than security. But if your choice is between a plastic shackle guard, which I don't particularly like, and no shackle guard at all, I have to admit that there are some advantages. For example, they can make it more difficult to shim a padlock. In fact, every single one of these could easily be shimmed were it not for the plastic shackle guard. It may also make it more difficult to position bolt cutters around the shackle, and it may be enough that it just looks beefier and a thief passes it in favor of a softer target. So, while I don't like this trend, they do have some limited advantages, though we should be very careful not to think they compare to their metal counterparts. Okay, let's turn our attention back to this little Vero and see what it takes to pick it open, if for no other reason than we really need picking in every video. So, we have what looks to be a master lock style keyway. So I'm using top of the keyway tension with a 40 thousandths thick pry bar and a standard hook in 18 thousandths. Nothing on one, two, three, four, Okay, five is binding. We probably bind from back to front, so let's work our way forward. Click out of four, click out of three, click out of two, click out of one, and we are open. So it felt like five standard pins and something that probably wouldn't give much pause to even a novice picker. In any case, that's all I have for you today. If you do have any questions or comments about this, please put them below. If you like this video and would like to see more like it, please subscribe, and as always, have a nice day. Thank you.